Pirelli's tyres undergo a revolution to tackle the 2013 Formula One season. The most obvious change is a new colour for the hard compound, which will now be distinguished by orange sidewall markings. From a technical point of view, there are two major changes, new compounds and new constructions. The work of the Pirelli engineers has centred on three key areas, combined traction, temperature distribution and performance improvements. There is more grip available through better combined traction, which reduces oversteer on the exit of the corner and allows the engine's full power to be used. Temperature distribution is improved. The contact patch distributes heat across the tyre in a more uniform way. Working together with the new compounds, the improved heat distribution over the tyre tread reduces blistering. Performance is improved. The greater amount of grip available and improved overall efficiency should lead to a reduction in lap times and will fix the performance gaps between each compound to between 6 tenths and 8 tenths of a second, favouring race strategy. As the construction and compounds change, so do the working ranges. Pirelli's four slick compounds include two tyres with a high working range and two tyres with a low working range. The hard and the soft tyres are designed to take in a high working range in excess of 100 degrees centigrade. Super soft and medium are designed for a lower working range, giving their best from 85 to 90 degrees. Both the wet tyres have evolved as well. In order to improve overall performance, the rear construction has been changed to ensure more progressive and consistent grip. The new 2013 F1 tyres are designed to make the most of any weather conditions they encounter, as well as all the different types of circuit and usage conditions that the teams and drivers put them through, without sacrificing speed, spectacle and safety. That's Pirelli's DNA.